uh, hey guys, uh, 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 Joshua Newman here, uh, from the channel, uh, Video Game Chain Poop, uh, my channel is, uh, this is just a quick video on, uh, on, uh, of, uh, it's about the game, uh, The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, uh, Master Quest bonus disc, uh, which I have here, I've made a custom art for it. But what we're specifically talking about in this video is the movies that are available on it. So, uh, so, so as most of you know, it, it includes the movies, uh, uh, Warrior World, uh, A Link to the Past, Plus Four Swords, uh, 1080 Lavalanche, uh, Metroid Prime, and a Hot Clips montage as well as f0 gx well what you won't know is that uh japanese versions of the game include more videos uh, so this this is what this video is going to be focusing on so uh so here we have my wii here and uh, uh i've homebrewed it you can see this homebrew channel uh and this is, and I am I am going to be showing uh, both the Japanese version and European versions. However, I don't have a Japanese disc, but I do have an ISO that I've put onto my uh, SD card to run on uh, Nintendo's on the Homebrew channel. So, uh, so we'll do it that way. So first. Well, first we'll put in the European disc. Although we're not going to boot up the European... We're going to boot up the Japanese version first, but I'm going to put in the European disc ready. So here it is. Oh, and if you're wondering... Uh, if it was released in Europe, yes it was. But... It was bundled with Wind Waker. Right here. Uh, unlike in the US where it was pre-order bonus. So another box would come with it. So I had to create a custom box myself. Yeah. But, as you can see here, the disc. Right here, this is the European version. So I'm going to put it in my way. First of all, let me just... There we go. But first, we're going to boot up the Japanese version. So I'm going to go to Homebrew Channel. Just like that. If you want to homebrew your Wii, uh, just look for videos yourself. And then I'm going to go to uh, Nintendo's. Uh, which allows you to play GameCube games on your Wii. Well, you can already play GameCube games on your Wii, but you know. Uh, no discs or... If you want to use the Wii U to play them, then that's fine. Yeah. Uh, SD card, I have that on. And then we can see here, I have the Ocarina of Time uh, multi-pack. That's the Japanese ISO of the game. That's on my SD card. So I'm going to boot it up. And I have to use a Geku controller. I've already plugged it in. Well, first, I'll get this screen. Uh, a progressive scanner. This is what is... This is... This is what you get in NTSC versions of games. You can't get them in PAL games. So, here's the menu. This is the Japanese one. So, as you can see here, uh, normal Ocarina of Time and Master Quest, which is Ura Zelda. Or, well, not Ura Zelda. Uh, uh, Toki no Ocarina Ura. But what we're focusing on is not the games. We're focusing on the movies. We press C or Z. And this is the movies. You can see, well, obviously it's in Japanese, but you can see there are some extra movies in this uh, version. So we got a uh, top one here. I can tell you the names of each. Uh, this one is Mario Party 4, uh, Resident Evil 0, which is Biohazard 0, uh, Ultimate Muscle Legend, I think it's, I think this one is. Uh, let me just read it. Ultimate Muscle Legends versus uh, New Gen Generation. Yes, I was right. 
Uh, that one is uh, Mr. Driller, Drill Land. F Zero GX, known as F Zero GC, on this in this disc. Uh, Resident Evil Four or Biohazard Four. Dead Phoenix, Beautiful Joe, PN03, Killer7, uh, Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past and Four Swords, and Final Fantasy Tactics Advance. So, 12 movies in the Japanese version. So yeah, 12 movies, right? Uh, now, uh, when they released the disc in America and Europe, they removed most of them, including the Resident Evil games, as well as Killer7 and uh, Beautiful Joe, Dead Phoenix, Piano, most of them. Uh, I'm guessing it's most likely due to rating-related reasons. And they were replaced with uh, 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 The Wind Waker, Metroid Prime, uh, what else? Um, Metroid Prime. Oh yeah, 1080 Avalanche, Warrior World, and a Hot Clips montage, which is like some other GameCube games, not the ones included on this Japanese version. Now, I'm going to boot each of them up to see, uh, to, to let you see what you've missed out on. So, first up, Mario Party 4. And ignore that bar there, that's just my converter. It sounded like it said Mario Party 2, but it's Mario Party 4. So that was Mario Party 4. And then uh, next up is uh, Resident Evil 0, Biohazard 0. And keep in mind that some of these games on this disc are not for children. So here's uh, Resident Evil 0. I don't really, it, To be honest, I'm not even sure if this is a remake of the first Resident Evil game from PlayStation 1 and Saturn. I don't know. Anyways, uh, next trailer after that, I believe it's Ultimate Muscle Legends. Here it is. And I think by the title, uh, I can see this is a sequel to another game. Apologize for that thing right there. Seems like this is a sequel to another game. And then, um, the next one is, uh, uh, Mr. Driller, uh, 
drill end. So, so far that was, I think, five of the videos, or was it, um, no, four. Uh, then it's F-Zero GX. Now, even though this is included in the, uh, US and European releases, it, it's a different video. Uh, in fact, the ones that are the same games in this version have different videos, so I'll show them off anyway. So here's F-Zero GX. I think this one's different anyway. I'm not, I'm not sure if that was actually different, but, um, although if you know if it's different, just, uh, leave a comment. Next up, uh, Resident Evil 4, or Biohazard 4, as it's known in Japan. Spooky. smoke effect. Oh, there's more. 2000X. I uh, don't know when that year's gonna come, but still, yeah, Capcom. But yeah, spoilers, most of these videos are from Capcom. So, uh, <laughs> uh next up, I believe it's, um, uh, uh, Dead Phoenix. Yeah. Never heard of that game. Uh, Dead Phoenix. <laughs> Looks like those games might end up doing this.
uh, speak of, Capcom's actually my favourite company, by the way. Uh, next up, it's uh, Beautiful Joe. I, be I believe, yep, Beautiful Joe. Beautiful Joe's Joe. <laughs> know what he said there but yeah in fact most of these videos have uh, like a Japanese narrator piano free or is it pn free I don't know how you really say it I think it's piano free I'm just gonna say that piano free I could be wrong though Almost all of the videos are from Capcom. <laughs> it's almost like this bonus disc was developed by Capcom. Like, Killer 7. Here we go. One of those games from Suda51, actually. In fact, the first one to be released outside Japan. Was me, not the video. Right, I believe the last two are. Oh yeah, they're both Game Boy Advances this time. Um, uh, a link to the past plus four swords and Final Fantasy Tactics first Zelda. And keep in mind, this one has a Japanese narration in this one, and the video is different as well. So.
So then the last one is uh, Final Fantasy uh, Tactics Advance. <laughs> So, so that is every single video uh, contained in the Japanese version of the game. Uh, so, uh, so yeah, it's got twelve videos, right? Now, let's look at. Now let's move on to the um, uh, European version. So I'm going to turn off my way, turn it back on. I have this uh, glitch for some reason. I always think my Wii is fried when that happens, but really it's not. It still works. Play my HDMI my adapter. This is difficult to do. So there we go. Uh, where's the Wii remote? Where's the Wii Wii remote? Found it. And then let's go up to the GameCube channel. Start! I hope it boots up. Is it gonna boot or? Now it's a bit difficult with my Wii because sometimes discs will not boot for some reason. It looks like it's not booting up. So, the method I'm going to use is, remember that we use uh, Nintendo for a Japanese version. Well, what we're going to do is, um, I'm going to um, boot uh, up uh, Nintendo on Homebrew Channel. And then load up the boot disc, boot GC disc. Uh, since you can boot up actual discs as well. As long as you have um, the correct files, uh, you can look at more of that on YouTube. So Nintendo, I need to get an image for the icon. So, so you'll you at the beginning of the video you'll notice I have um, you'll notice I have this boot GC disk in Drive. Well, that actually boots up the disk, whatever GameCube disk is in your uh, drive. So in this case, it's the PAL version of uh, Ocarina of Time Master Quest bonus disk. So, uh, just boot it up. There we go. This time, we don't get the progressive scan, and it only runs in 60 years, and we get the red Nintendo logo since... Japanese games usually have the blue one. You've seen that a lot in this video, to be honest. So now here is the uh, English version. Uh, so this time we only have seven videos. Uh, Wind Waker, Metroid Prime, F-Zero GX is just listed as F-Zero in this. Unlike the Japanese one, it's F-Zero GC. Uh, Tinity Avalanche, Warrior World, Hot Clips, which is a montage of GameCube games, and A Link to the Past, although the video is very different. So, I'm not going to show them off because I, I'm pretty sure most of you have already seen these. So, uh, so yeah, that's about it 
for um, the uh, movies included, but there's more. I need to explain. So, I have I've created my uh, custom room floor page. Hold on. So I I have a cutter room floor account right here, and uh, this is um. Uh, what it will say. So it says the selection of trailers present differs by region. So the Japanese version has uh, the most trailers and uh, promoted the ill-fated Capcom 5. Uh, so so as we've seen, the Japanese one includes Mario Party 4, Resident Evil 0, as well as Resident Evil 4, uh, Ultimate Muscle Legends uh, versus uh, New Generation, uh, Mr. Driller Drill Land, uh, Dead Phoenix, uh, Beautiful Joe, Killer7, Piano3, and Final Fantasy Tactics Adventures. American the American and European versions replaced them with Wind Waker, Metroid Prime, 1080 Avalanche, Wario World, and a Hot Clips montage. Uh, the only ones that are shared uh, are F-Zero GX uh, and uh, A Link to the Past and Four Swords, which are different, which is a different video. But there's there are two more versions the australian version and the korean version uh so in those versions so in the australian version uh the australian version only has metroid prime uh, a link to the past and four swords and hot clips and the korean version has all of them except uh hot clips and uh a link to the past and four swords so basically all GameCube games besides hot clips. Uh because I could I've edited this here to see for the list of each. So you can see the Japanese version has more uh videos. And uh American version has seven, Australia has three. You're unlucky Australia. And Korea has all of the American and European ones except for two, Hot Clips and uh, Zelda, A Link to the Past. Uh, so, yeah. Plus, if you're curious of how much it costs on eBay, I can show it off. Uh, if you want to get a Japanese copy, so I'll type in Zelda. Uh, I'll have to type in the Japanese name. Uh, Tokino Ocarina GC. Uh, Japan. I'm typing that. Uh, you'll... Hold on. You can see that, well, for now at least, well, this is the N64 version and then the 3DS version. Here is the GameCube version. Uh, uh, not a lot of money, but it's still very expensive to get. Although, this is the UK site because I'm in the UK. Uh, uh, but you can technically get it if you don't have the money for it or if you want to save your money on anything else. You can download the ISO for the game since it's available on like uh, a few ROM sites. Uh, I'm not going to say which ones though. Uh, but it is available on some ROM sites. Uh, and um, what else what was I going to say? Uh, oh yeah, if we search up uh, uh, Zelda um, Ocarina of Time bonus disc or or Ocarina of Time, uh, I'll just uh, so GameCube. There we go. Uh, you can see. Uh, uh, Wind Waker is not a lot of money, but it still may cost more, depending if it comes with the disc or not. Uh, I got mine separately, because the, the version of Wind Waker I have is, uh, at the moment, is, uh, the, uh, version that was not bundled with the, the other disc. Uh, mine was sold separately, so, uh, but in America you could get a actual box, well, or in the UK if you have, like, um, uh, like, this is the UK version, 
right here, but it comes with the American box art. Uh, although, as with the case of mine, you could always print uh, a box yourself. That's what I did. I did a custom one uh, myself. You can do a custom one if you want. And yeah, you can see here, not a lot of money. In fact, sometimes they're expensive. It depends on the condition. Uh, for Australian versions, uh, I've not looked at them yet. Let me just uh, look at them now. Australia. Um, I don't think it will come up in my uh, results, but unless I've got an idea. I've got an idea. Uh, go to the um, eBay Australia. eBay Australia. Then, so ebay.com.au. Then I'm going to type in Zelda Ocarina of time GameCube then it should come up with Australian versions so well some are from the UK obviously and uh, let me just go to best match and then uh, low price and you can see uh, very expensive for Aust the Australia but you can see where we're going <laughs> Now, um, yeah, although you can technically get any version, as long as you have, like, a, a, a boot disk to load them, or if you mod your GameCube to be region-free, since the GameCube is region-locked. Uh, same thing for the Wii, but, but you could also, uh, you could also use the Nintendo method, like I used, uh, to boot them. Uh, Japanese discs as well. And American discs on my European way. That works as well. Uh, and, um, yeah, that's about it for this video. Uh, so, um, uh, thanks uh, for watching, I guess. And uh, be sure to uh, subscribe to uh, my channel, Video Game Jay and Poop. And, uh, as well as my second channel, uh, reuploads Jay and Poop. That video focuses. That channel focuses on reuploads of deleted videos I managed to download before they got deleted. S or it's not just about that. It's also about videos that still exist, like mostly today, but I combined them into one. They maybe slightly edit it to avoid copyright, but still. Uh, so yeah, that's about it for. This, um, <laughs> it happened to my way again. Uh, hold on. <sighs> uh, I need to get the disc out. There we go. Uh, so, be sure to uh, like and subscribe. And I'll catch you next time. So, uh, see you later, guys. Peace out.